become your own best friend. Like for me, and then my husband, I always tell him this, I enjoy my alone time because I, I, I connect with myself. I don't need to have to be around everybody, although I do like to be around people, but I love to be by myself. I hated to be by myself before when I was drinking because I was afraid and I had so much fear, like, oh, I don't want to be feeling this way. What's wrong with me? I enjoy myself. And so finding things that you enjoy doing, start with that, you know, and then eventually I think later on in time, you will then start opening up and start maybe meeting people like another great website that I did, especially as a new mom, is I went on to meetup.com, whatever habits you love to do or whatever, you know, like hobbies you enjoy, look that up. So whether if it's like chess, a book club, you know, exercise group, hiking group, start with that and see. And if you really want to start hanging around with sober people, look up, just go on Google and just sit sober events. You'll find a lot. And then you can connect with like-minded women who are wanting to become sober. Got it. Got it. Okay. So next question, can you describe your overall approach to supporting people in the recovery journey? So how does what you do and how you help people differ from the traditional uh, 12 step programming? 